because so the the so-called standard model Higgs particle, and I should just say for a minute that that thing, the existence of this thing was predicted in the 1960s by Peter Higgs and others. And um, it was a suggestion, a theory, a guess, let's say at the time, mathematically motivated, almost purely, by the way, mathematically motivated, of how things get mass in the universe at the most fundamental level. So how the quarks and the, these, these very heavy things called the W and Z bosons, that, how, how those things got mass. Um, and so it was a, a mathematical construct. It predicted that there should be, a, in the simplest case, one, this thing, the Higgs boson. But there could be more, more complicated versions. And so we knew that if we collided protons together at the energies that we generate at the Large Hadron Collider, then we would either discover the Higgs boson and prove this theory to be correct, or we knew that if it wasn't there, we would see something else. So we had a very clear idea from experiment and theory that we were going to discover something with that machine. 